Heavy, heavy, he's got heavy larges. No, 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 no. No, 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 good sir. Hi friends and welcome back to Jump Engineering. I'm your host TTB today with the Thanatos in a full-on large X pulse laser build. Let's go. Fuel at 25%. Okay, let's get shot in the face. I haven't seen anything over here, anything over here, but there's gonna be a dude over here. Unfortunately, we have a left side picking build. Oh, hello. Hi there. Hi there. Have I told you about the load and saver artillery strike? Nobody here? What? So, I'm in Echo 6. I don't see anything. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Huh. Huh. Echo 6, uh, Delta 6. Couple of targets behind. Okay. I don't know. I feel a little bit weird here. It feels like nobody's stepping up. Which, of course, is the case. So, let's make use of our sniper lords. And go over here. shoot here unfortunately but I think we can keep going and go further to the side here this is what three jump jets get you by the way in this Thanatos three tons of jump jets lift about as much as a war rust fighting heavy and assault jump jets are just not giving you enough thrust Okay, so now we have this weird situation where we're shooting on all the different sides. I'm just gonna help kill this guy if he shows again. No? Okay. Let's go here then. Hello. Well, I should have had my strike for that one. That would have been nice. They have this amazing mega tactic. Now, part of their amazing mega tactic is to utilize the fact that our snipers are not <laughs> not able to shoot them because they're not there. this. Now we can. I got something. Uh oh. Uh oh. They're pissed. Oh, fuck. What? Yep. Oh, it's just warm. <sighs> Hello, how's it going? We have still zero kills for some reason. Well, this is good actually. He's in range. This is not good. Left horse being shot is really bad. I need that thing. And there's a naked annihilator. Okay. Jack should be dead. Okay, I need to hold this corner now. Need to use my positioning here because anything else is gonna be bad. Target 
Okay. They'll be watching that Huntsman as well. Alright, let's take down the Annihilator. Just gonna walk into us and be annoying. There we go. Nice. What's that? Okay, damn it, I had this corner held. Ah, this could be very good or very bad, what I'm doing right now. He's, heavy, he's got heavy larges. No, 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 no. No, 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 good sir. What does the King Crab have? BPC Gauss. <laughs> he's looking at me. Target acquired. Let's not deal with that. Target destroyed. New target acquired. The bushy. Hmm. What is he talking about? Mm -hmm. Oh, what just happened? I'm blind. Ah, oh, there he is. Where is he running off to, to our flag? Go for the cap hero play? Target spotted. What, is he, what does he think he's doing? Oh, okay, he's dead. Oh, we found it. Target destroyed. Ooh. Oh, man. Thankfully our assaults came in and thankfully the enemy team did not push as we didn't have numbers or we would have been so dead. <sighs> Three kills, two KVDs, 1045 done, 400 taken, 8 components destroyed. But TTB, that clearly proves that large X pulse lasers are good. No. It just proves that once again, in a 9 minute game, if you keep shooting your weapons, you're going to do damage. 620 match score. But, I mean, this is almost 600 meters range for the large X-Pulse. That's not bad. It's a big target to hit though. It's a big target to hit. Artillery strike online. Oops. 1200, I can't reach this. Sadly. Mm -hmm. But he can reach me. Um, didn't mean to fall down there. Do you have enough juice to jump up there? With three jump jets? The answer is barely. It is barely enough. I also forgot my second cool shot.
Hmm, my, what do, what cute blue lasers you have. I hit them quite nicely, actually. Time to get a move on, I guess. Oh, what was that? Drop down, yes. Currently engaged with four enemy Max, by the way, in case anybody is keeping track. That's a little bit too much. We are shooting a little bit out of range, but the advantage of it here is that uh, we're shooting up to hit level maximum and then we stop. Then we can get back to cover. So that's actually not horrible. Target spotted. Target spotted. Target spotted. What now? Target. Of course. Mm -hmm. Yo, get him! Get him, Timby! Get him! A little bit warm right now to cool down. There's my friend from before again. He just dropped down and he thinks he's safe, but he's not. Team is really falling apart here. Fuel at twenty five percent. Oh, that's the Hellbringer. I think he's gonna be, Target yep, destroyed. dead. Well, that was a lot of shooting at about 750, so like maybe 500 damage. I don't know, I can't really tell. No, ah, 700, okay, so not horrible. Imagine what we could have done if we shot that at 100 meters closer. One KMDD, 700 done, and uh, one component destroyed. Yeah. GG. I'd say those were some pretty solid matches. Here's the build on screen, guys. As you can see, we're running a light engine 300. Got an ECM in the left torso, of course. We have our four large X pulse lasers. Uh, do take note that this is a left sided build because there are no energy hard points in the right arm. TC Mark 1 in the head slot, and then we have three. Jump jets plus three extra double heat sinks. As far as the crooks are concerned, let's see where the magic happens. Right here, 10% heat and in a sphere large pulse laser heat skill limit plus one. This makes this build work. Um, I would still like PGI to lower the heat on all X pulse lasers by about 10 to 15% minimum. 20 better, but 10 to 15% I think is a good spot. And then with the heat quirk, it would be even better. We also get some armor on the CT, right torso and left torso, and some structure, left arm, right arm left leg and right leg from our crooks but the most important thing here is of course the heat scale plus one that allows us to shoot four large x pulse lasers at the same time as you could see from the video we are left-sided so keep that in mind it's really good to pick left side it's not so good to pick right side because you have to fully expose your whole mech in order to be able to shoot at targets your arm mounted weapons of course can shoot down uvs easily a couple of pokes will do it other than that ecm will keep you safe and of course you can use your right arm a little bit to deflect some damage if you need to.
try this build guys let me know how it goes for you i thought this was kind of a weird mech a little bit ugly looking but fun to play nonetheless so i'm happy that we were able to show one of those big boys again but i'm also of course happy about is to say thank you to all my beautiful supporters couldn't do this without you if you're not a supporter yet but would like to become one check out the various links in the video description for example the link to patreon you can check out the super thanks slash join button right here on youtube or you can head over to the merch store and grab yourself something nice whatever you do thank you